Hey folks, Leo Schumann here. Okay, so you know what they say about... Oh, I just can't do it. Thought if you start with a horrible cliche, they're going to be fascinated, right? And no. <laughs> Let's get on to something interesting. The Adobe Flash platform and the Adobe Digital Enterprise platform. Okay, so what have we got going on here? If you're watching this, I expect you already know a bit about the Adobe Flash platform. Maybe you're new to mobile and tablet development, which is cool. That's what this session is about. But you know it's a set of SDKs for mobile, tablet, desk, and web development. And specific to mobile and tablet development, we've got a set of lightweight, touch, and orientation-aware controls and components to ease your development against a single code base and a common runtime for multiple target mobile and tablet platforms. That's pretty sexy stuff if you got your management glasses on. But wait, there's more. Okay, the Adobe Digital Enterprise platform, what is it? You may have heard about it, but it's a set of services that include, but is not limited to, a standards-based content repository, composite application framework, digital asset management, enterprise-grade web analytics, data services you may already know and love, an authentication, task and workflow management, a whole lot more. In this particular one-day session, we're going to learn what is the Adobe Digital Enterprise Platform in general, enough to get you dirty and dangerous, and then a bit about the underlying technology, OSGI, what problems does it solve, enough to give you some context. And then specifically, in a set of detailed hands-on exercises, you're going to learn how to configure Flash Builder for mobile and ADEP projects, You'll learn how to create and debug a mobile project using Flash Builder. You'll authenticate your user against the ADEP. You'll use lightweight navigation and data management views. You'll implement custom task management. You'll respond to device orientation in your screen layout. You'll use touch-aware navigation action and menu items. A whole lot more. So if this sounds like a toolkit that you could put to use, come to Adobe Max. Learn how to develop multi-screen applications with Flash Builder with the Adobe Digital Enterprise Platform. I look forward to seeing you there.